Hello, everyone. Uh, welcome to day two of the NFL draft. I wanted to do a little uh, preview of what I wanted for day two. And it's really fucking ironic because I really wanted to bring up all the fucking proof of how accurate I am with this fucking team. My Twitter is where everything I say that becomes true is where it's at. Anyways, um, so I, I guess we could just talk then about the day one needs, uh, D line receiver. Cause guess what? Today we addressed wide receiver and defensive line, uh, second round with our first pick. Um, we went with George Pickens from Georgia for sure. His first name is George. I think so. Pickens, whatever. I don't remember. I don't know. It's a long day at work. It's got done working 12. Um, good receiver out of Georgia. Um, really, uh, a first round talent is what I heard, but just lit because character concerns. <laughs> Great. Another receiver with character problems. That's what we needed. Uh, I'm not going to hit on the pick. I heard nothing but good things about him. Uh, big play receiver. Like a lot of his catches were big time plays, just like so. Hey, you know, Sky Moore was there, but I'm cool with him. Um, you know, that gives us someone to potentially replace Deontay next year. God forbid, I hope not. Um, but gives us another receiver, which we needed. So now we got Deontay Chase potentially working in and out of the slot a little bit there. Uh, Pickens, pick it to Pickens. I know that's going to be fucking the new trend. Um, and, uh, Miles Boykin, Anthony Miller, and I think that's really about it. Um, so there goes that. Um, so now we got lots of skill position players were loaded there. And we took a defensive lineman out of Texas A&M. Uh, I don't remember his first name, Kayvon O'Neal. I want to say roughly, I don't remember his name off the not top of my head, uh, but a D tackle, which is what we needed. Um, heard a little bit about this dude. I haven't watched anyone's highlights yet. I'll definitely watch some highlights and tape soon. Uh, I usually wait till after the players were picked just to kind of see what they're about. But I heard, I read this this defensive line from T Texas A&M uh, can play interior or edge. Probably not really on the edge, but definitely more as a 3-4 D end or a D tackle, maybe nose tackle, whatever. We needed a defensive lineman. We needed defense, and I'm glad we got a defensive player, so I like that pick as well. So I really liked our day two picks, um, to be honest with you, getting receiver and defensive line. So now it's like, you know, on day three, what do we look to? Maybe... Uh, offensive line, maybe some secondary. I'm not sure, but I am very happy with our day two. A lot more happy with our day one pick, though. Though I do understand, after looking back at it, kind of analyzing things, I understand why we took Pickett. But look at where the quarterbacks went today. Rounds two and three. Malik Willis didn't even get drafted until after Desmond Ritter to fucking Atlanta to Tennessee. So these people who make come up with these drafts and mock drafts, they don't know shit. They don't know shit. And honestly, I feel like we definitely overdrafted Pickett, if I'm being honest. But that's for another time. I'm out of here. Day two, I'll, I'll give it an A for sure. I like the picks. I'm out.